Islam, which was given by the Holy Prophet Muhammad alayhi salatu was salam, is a dynamic and revolutionary force. Islam, which we have today in the fashion we have, in the form of a cult, is something meaningless. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has laid down the law for Muslims that they should try to build this world first and the next world next. That law is there in the Quran. You have been asked to pray, Rabbana atina fi dunya hasana wa fi akhirati hasana. O Lord, give us the best of this world first. First, give us the best of this world. وَفِي الْآخِرَةِ حَسَنَا and then give us the best of the next world. We have put the card before the horse. If we become religious, we think only in terms of otherworldliness. The other world is real. We must work for it, definitely. And a spiritual life is the highest life. We must build that life. But we must keep the logical sequence intact as taught in the Holy Quran. Build this world first. And the verse which Hafiz I have read at the last of his lecture, as I mean say towards the end of, of his lecture, Kuntum khaira ummatin ukhridat lin nasi ta'muruna bil ma'rufi wa tanhawna anil munkari wa tu'minuna billah. Think on this verse. What is the mission of this community? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, you are the best ideological group. Ukhrijat lin nas, which has been established by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the service of entire mankind. Ukhrijat lin nas. For the service of entire mankind. And the service which you have got to render is to establish all that is good everywhere in the world and to eliminate and eradicate all that is evil from all over the earth and to do it not as mevans and surtis and kachis and bhaiyas but as soldiers of Allah. Only as soldiers of Allah are we doing this job? Yani to establish good all over the world in entire humanity and to eradicate evil from there. That is a much greater job than to eradicate evil from our own community and to establish good in our own community. Of even of that we have no consciousness. And we remain in a piety complex that there are certain types of complexes which emerge in a human being. He might suffer from inferiority complex or he might suffer from superiority complex and he can also suffer from piety complex. I am a very pious man. We suffer from it. Those among us who are religious, they are made to suffer. Because they are told about secondary things, very ordinary things in Islam, 